Okay, probably one of my favorite features of this particular setup is that you can move from this to a different program. I'm just going to open the other program itself, okay? It's called Launch Key. Now, Launch Key is a synthesizer. A synthesizer is a um, program that creates sound, okay? Basically, you've got a whole bunch of controls here, which by now it shouldn't surprise you, these controls are mapped to here. So if that one's cut off, I can sort of make that move up and down. I can't see if you can see that on the on the video, but should be able to hopefully. As I move along, I can sort of change all these different sounds. Now we've got two buttons here. One's called on and latch, and that's connected to what's called the arpeggiator. I'll show you what that does actually, that's probably the easiest thing. So if I just press one uh, one key, it's gonna keep playing because it's latched. Also, it's playing a pattern. You can obviously play these notes on, the, on there or in here. Okay. Pitch bend works. mod wheel. It does different things to different sounds. If I turn off latch, you'll find it's, it's just the arpeggio. Turn off. Now if I play a couple of notes, okay, you can see what it sort of starts to sound like. If I use the octave button, All sorts of fun. Now, you can change the sounds subtly by these green buttons. It, have a look at what it does to the screen. It moves a little orange circle to the multicolored circles. Okay, have a listen to what that does. <laughs> That does something called modulating the sound. Modulating is just a fancy word for changing. Now you can also just move that circle of thing around. So yeah, all sorts of fun, fun sounds. Okay. Um, so that's that. If you want to change the, the, the main sound, that's why we've got these buttons for. Okay, and again I can... Put the arpeggio on. I'll have all sorts of fun with that. Okay. Um, let's go for old school. Um, and that's part of the fun of it. Experiment, get some uh, uh, all kinds of weird sounds. This one here is called Wubbish. Okay, if I um, use the octave button to make it nice and low pitched, and use um, the sixth one along, says so LFO2 speed. That's the sixth one here, so. Thank <laughs> you. 
A lot of fun you can have with that. Okay, but the really good thing with this is, of course, if you press the track button, it automatically loads up Launchpad. That is the beauty of it. So what you've been doing there... You might need to find it when you swap between the two, you need to just turn the effects off and on just so the, the pads correspond again. So... Okay. So, the idea is you can create a performance here and play over it. So it becomes a complete live performance tool in whatever style of electronic dance music you like. That's the, that's the, the joy of it, so see what you can do with it. Have fun.